So a lot of people, they love Lululemon yoga pants. Uh, they're supposed to be very flattering. I, I don't have that many Lululemon yoga pants. What I, what I really love to buy from Lululemon is the, the tank tops just because I do have a hard time finding tank tops with built-in bras that are actually supportive enough to not have to double up with another bra. I just think that wearing a sports bra is the unnecessary hassle when I could just buy a Lululemon tank top and that's good enough. So yeah, as you can see, this is a recent tank top and this one has a, a shelf bra and it also has removable pads. This is the Cardio Kick Tank. It didn't sell very well, but I really find this one to be so functional because it has like a heavy duty bra. It's really supportive and I can actually do high impact activities like running in this one. See, it has this mesh material, which is more breathable. And then almost all Lululemon tank tops also have a, a pocket in the back. And when I'm running, I just put my keys and student ID in there. And it's just so handy because I don't need to hold anything when I run. I actually really like this one. I bought it in three colors. This is my favorite of the three. I really like pink. <laughs> Here's the one with some color blocking. This, in terms of style, is one of my favorite tanks. I do be careful when buying Lululemon because some of the tank tops, especially the ones with rouged, uh, rouged bust area, tend to emphasize that area too much. This has a, a small shelf bra but it doesn't have this one anyway, it doesn't have a lot of support and this one's more of a cotton material. So actually I just wear this as a pajama. This one does tend to show a lot of cleavage. So actually I don't wear this one very often except when I'm lounging around studying. And this one, like also a lot of tanks, you can modify the straps to crisscross in the back. Now this, of all my Lululemon tank tops, has to be my favorite style. This is called the, the Light Up or Speed Up tank. And this one, it just... I, I even took the cups out. I don't always wear them. But it has so much support. It has the best support of all my Lululemon tank tops. And it has these thick bands, the mesh in the back, and a zip pocket. It also has this elastic band on the inside to help stick to your body. This is definitely, I think, one of the most functional and cutest tops I have. I bought it in this gray color too, and this one's even better. It has this reflective panel on the tank straps. This is probably the oldest style I have. I think this is called the Ujjayi tank. I actually really like a lot of the older patterns. I'm not so fond of the new ones. And I also have it in this Senorita pink. Yeah, this is, this is probably the oldest I have. I think this one's made in Canada. Now they're usually made in, a, in Asian countries. I guess I'll show the pants next, since that's what I have the second most of. These are the heated up crops. Just pretty standard. A, a lot of people criticize Lululemon for being see-through, but I, 
either I haven't observed it well enough or it isn't that much of a problem. I've tried testing out a couple of pants I have and I I don't think that the see-through is that big of an issue. These these are the heated up shorts for hot yoga and I'm not sure now why I bought them. I think I just also wear these when I'm studying by myself. I, I don't actually, I just can't see wearing them to class now. This is another thing I bought recently and I really like pink. I thought they were pink in the store, but actually, yeah, they're really orange. I might give these away. I'm not particularly fond of them. This is my, this is my favorite Lululemon pant. These are called the Astro Pants, and they have a medium to high waistband. You can also uh, modify the waistband. You can lower it by folding this down. It, it adjusts. And these I really like because the material is thicker than a lot of the other pants. And it's really soft. It just has a more luxurious feel. And I haven't shown you yet, but here's a tag. The tags are actually perforated and you can remove them really easily. Now here are, I think these are called the Run Inspire 2.0 crops. These are really popular. You'll, you'll probably recognize them from this bottom part. Of all the Lululemon pants I have, this is the only one I noticed was a little sheer when I squat. So, also this ma this material is noticeably different from the Astro pants. It's a lot thinner and it's not very soft. So I I wouldn't repurchase these. It does have a pocket though. They pretty much all have pockets though. Um. The other item I do like from Lululemon are the pullovers. This is the Rise and Shine. I think this is made from Ruan. It's just of everything I own, Lululemon, this is the softest fabric. And it's it doesn't look like it, but it is so light. It's pretty sheer. I actually have gone running in it. It's really light. And like most all the pullovers, it does have a thumb hole. Which I actually really like the thumb holes because I ride my bicycle to class and I was noticing that my hands were getting really tan compared to my arm, so just having this covering my hand is, is really helpful in itself. Here's another, uh, I guess, sweatshirt. This one has a lot of ruching. It's really attractive. Shorts. I only have a few shorts from Lululemon. This is their best seller. I highly recommend these. These are called uh, some speed shorts. They're a little short, but look, it's so ingenious. They made the front shorter than the back. That way it covers your bum. And also they have these vents on the side. Can you see that? It opens up here, it's a vent for additional circulation. And yeah, it has a standard pocket. There's actually vents all along the back. And for me, I'm five foot five and 
I don't think they look that short on me anyway. But if you're taller, it, it could restrict some movement. These, um, just standard, like, spandex type shorts. I just like to wear them really only underneath skirts when I ride my bike to class. That's the only time I wear those. And I also run in these. These are, like, dolphin shorts. This one, actually, it doesn't have a pocket in the back, but they put a pocket on the inside small one so they they always pay attention to detail um, this is I think it's called groovy run short hope you can see um, this is pretty standard it's comfortable it has a built-in liner and it has a draw string cord on the inside I was actually going to compare these to the Zella shorts I have. See these Zella shorts? These are a medium, but they're just slightly too large. Um, also, the Zellas have no pocket on the back. It does have these side pockets, but the problem with them is every time I wore, every time I wear these, whatever the activity, the pockets flip out which really gets in the way I don't want to have to worry about that when exercising also there's a drawstring cord but it has these loose ends it's just not as neat as the Lululemon and the fabric is totally different it's, it's not as it's not as silky it's silky feeling um, it feels rougher, it's also thinner, and the thing about these shorts I thought was bizarre, it has these, like, dirt, they're, it's not dirt, but after I took them from the laundry, it got these spots on them, and I told my mom about it, and she said, she actually has them on her shorts too. So it's not just from the communal laundry, it's something about the shorts. So then really the last type of item I buy from Lululemon are the, the bras. Um, I just have a couple for when I wear shirts like, like this one. I do really like the t-shirts. This one I bought just <laughs> really because it is supposed to give a lot of support, and I like the back straps. This is called the Energy Bra. I'm not sure you can see, though. There we go. has these crisscross straps in the back. I don't think it's anything special, in short. I just like the way that the straps look. I would not repurchase this. Um, I actually do like the Zella, well I only have one Zella bra, but that one gives more support for me. I pretty much nowadays, I just don't even, like I said, I don't buy sports bras, I just invest in getting tank tops with built-in bras. This one I, I did buy recently, this is the heated up bra, and I bought this for, for hot yoga because it has <laughs> it has this front clasp. You know, when you get so hot and sticky, it's just so difficult to take your uh, top off. It's just so handy that this one unlocks from the front. And this is, is by far, in my opinion, the best bra that Lululemon makes. If you're larger chested, um, this one you should take a look at because it has thick adjustable straps. Most Lululemon bras do not have adjustable straps. And it also has three different places to hook and it has three hooks. 
Uh, this is called the Tata Tamer, and they make it in um, sizes 32 to 38 from cup C to E. So this one is by far, it has the most support. You could do any activity. And I also received this as a gift, but in a 34. Uh, because Lululemon does run kind of small. They thought a 34 would fit better, but I actually had to exchange it for my actual size, a 32, which just shows, to me anyway, that this bra does run true to size. Uh, really the last thing I have from Lululemon are some socks. I've tried these before, the Women's Run for Sun. I was looking for some really super sheer thin socks. So these ones, these ones are really good for that. If you need super thin socks that feel like you're not even wearing any. <laughs> Speaking of not wearing any, I also like the, the underwear. The, um, I'll say here <laughs> which underwear I like to buy, but I bought like 20 pairs of them this summer and I bought them because they're you cannot see them when you wear yoga pants there's no panty lines so I highly recommend those underwear actually I like them just as much as the Lulu lemon tank tops this is their best-selling headband um, it's the best headband I've ever tried. It's really great for hot yoga. Actually, it does keep all your hair in place. Um, I don't wear headbands often, but if you need one to keep sweat out of your eyes and hair out of your face, this is, this is probably the best headband.